Why she is Bologna? Bologna? I don't know where I'm going. We are in Italy. I'm out of breath. I'm waiting for the YCS. So the people in backpacks, but destroy them. <laughs> but also, they're kind of helping me right now. Cause I don't know where to go. <laughs> I don't know where the YCS is right now. So I'm just following the nerds in the backpack. I'm sure it goes the right direction. Who's the nerd? I'm the nerd, bro. I'm out of breath after running for like one minute. I have no cardio. Cause I spent all my time running in your dreams. Anyways, all right, guys, really. Let's go win this shit. I'm playing 60 card Manadium with simple spoils, boost deals, magician souls, everything. Will my opponent get the, how do people beat Manadium? Stop the normal summon, right? That won't fucking matter anymore. Cause we have 25 extenders now. So let's win this shit. Round one's about to start right now. In five minutes, I'm winning. I did not come to Italy to lose. Let's go. See my victims. Let's go, baby. The best thing. Let's go. Yo, what's up? What's up? What's up? He's a really bad lover, and this is fun. Thank you. Yes, yes. Let's go. Yo, you guys are something really cool right now. I'm gonna destroy every one of them. Go, Forza Uve. Oh, Forza Uve. Forza Napoli. Napoli sucks. No, I'm kidding. Go Napoli. Go Napoli. Guys, European events are so crazy. Holy shit, everything's so big. Round one's about to start. This is my opponent. You gonna beat me? You gonna beat me? Easily. <laughs> Guys, we lost the dice roll. Doesn't matter. We prepared to go second. We're gonna do. This. We don't want to go second, but we're prepared for it. Let's go. I'll tell you how it goes after this. Are you gonna win? Maybe. I don't know. Oh, that's not what he told me, bro. You told me. He told me he's gonna 2-0 you five minutes. That's gonna be a good one. All right, guys, see you guys round two. First of all, we'd like to thank our partners, the staff, and the judges who helped to make all of these events possible. Round one just finished. I'm dropping. Well, this ice cream is damn good, bro. God, holy shit, this is good. Yeah, so I actually lost. I actually can't believe this. I got fucking slapped, bro. I couldn't do anything about it. Ah, fuck, bones! I literally got ice cream to literally, you know how, like, a girl, when the uh, Petro player breaks up with a girl because we're cooler than everyone, uh, they sit there and, like, eat ice cream? That's literally what I'm doing as we speak right now. I got slapped so hard that the guy made me fucking eat ice cream. To put my sorrow away. It was good. He, he's playing Unchained. He had a full board. So I think this is my first lost Unchained probably ever in my life. He had a nice board, a full board. I almost broke it just with like this deals and stuff. And then uh, round two, I got shi or sorry, game two, I got shifter. I actually had a decent play for shifter, but he had a uh, OTK, like full Unchained hand. And it's unfortunate. But uh, this ice cream is damn good. So I don't even care. Me eating this ice cream after I lost round fucking one is the equivalent of Joe Biden eating the ice cream in that fucking meme, bro. Hey, yo, what the fuck? Pathetic. Bro, I'm still the goat. Let's go. That's why I eat the goat. <laughs> yeah. Oh, not nice people. Forty. Valare, do do do, ode la mane, ode mane. I'm an opera singer. Let's go. I'm gonna win the tournament. Let's go. I love this city and country. All right, guys. Round two finished. I drew. I don't know what's worse, my hairline or my record. Oh my god. Bro, we're 1-1 one, one right now, X-1-1. One, one. Absolutely insane. Anyways, we're about to bounce back. I gotta go on a walk right now and clear my mind. Because there's no way in, on God's green earth I came all the way to Italy to fucking go X-1-1. One, one. So, I need to fix this. The only way I'm gonna go X-1-1 one, one is I win the next fucking 10. I'm winning the next 10, bro. I'm winning the next 10, that's it. I gotta go, I'll be back. I gotta, I gotta clear my mind. I can't believe this right now. Alright guys, I don't know how the heck I just got here, I literally started to walk, 
But if I could ever find a place to clear my mind, it's in the middle of a stairway that leads to nowhere. The stairway just keeps going. I'm just gonna follow it. Sala Almanda. I don't know what the heck that means. All right, this is, seems like a good place to clear my mind. All right, bro. We're X1 one right now. That is horrible. So quite simply, we gotta do right now, we gotta win the next 10. No ifs, ands, or buts. We have to win the next 10, and that's it. We have to. I'm topping this event, no matter what. So we're X1-1 right now. We're gonna win the next ones. And that's it. We're not gonna take no for an answer. I'm gonna tell my opponent I'm gonna win the next one. That's it. We cannot lose. We cannot lose. All right, guys, we're update. We won the round, last round, so 1-1-1. One, one, one. I told you guys I'm going 10 in a row. I was in the, that stairs in there. I talked, bro. Zark himself came down those stairs and talked to me. And Zark told me I'm winning 10 in a row. Now, round four, we win this. So we're 2 1 1 right now. Shit record, don't get me wrong. Ass record. However, it's not how you handle the, the wins that makes you a champion, it's how you handle the losses. And we're handling like a champ. We're taking the, the, the punches on the chin. But luckily, my beard's fucking jacked as fuck. So we take the punch and put it back. That made no sense. But now we're going to win the next six games and we're going to top. That's it. No matter what. Well, the only people that fucking lose are losers and we're winners, just like you guys watching. Let's go. Six more dubs. Yo, what's up, guys? I just want to take this time to make an announcement that I'm going to win the next 10 games in a row. Let's go. That stairs did wonders. Gracias. That's Spanish. Wrong country. I'm going to win the next 10. I'm gonna, am I going to win the next 10? Yes. He said I'm going to win the next 10. I'm going to win the next 10. I don't even know what a loss is. Let's go. We're winning. Yeah. Yo, bro, am I going to win the next 10 games? 10 matches. 10? Ten, ten. I'm going to win, right? You're going to win. Thank you. Thank you. Yo, we're in that match. We're literally X1-1 right now. We cannot lose another match. No way. I get hit with troll. I'm sitting there. Like, my life flashes before my eyes. And I'm like, no, I'm not going out like this. There's no fucking way. I'm here to fucking talk. I'm not going to let all of you guys down. There's no way. Off sheer fucking willpower, we pulled through. Bro, draw full combo. Baron hit Baron to spatter all this shit. We somehow miraculously pull through. That was the greatest victory in the history of Manadium Tulis ever and we're gonna continue doing exactly such oh hey guys oh, oh is it oh i thought it was for oh, ladies no, no, no. i didn't know you guys are ladies <laughs> i got like i'm filming here but anyways i'm gonna take a shit guys i probably shouldn't say that out loud and i'll see you guys after we the next round yo just played rescue ace lost dice roll full board my hand was so shit i lost game one game two get four hand three hand traps bro three we won game two. Uh, game three, he had full board with the firewall stuff and Valor. So he had Valor plus full board, like with firewall. So it's a normal set four. Anyways, uh, even late. Ah, let's go. I told you, Matt, when you make up in your mind, life hack. Life hack. Just don't lose. Just don't lose. If you have that in your mind, you're never going to lose. It's simple mathematics. So we're now 3 1 1. Uh, started poorly, finished middle right now is good. Now we're gonna end fantastic. So, in order to, there's four more rounds today. In order to top, there's three tomorrow, four today. So, there's seven rounds left to play for top before top cut. You have to go, it's top 64 because there's so many players. So, you have to go six wins, one loss, aka seven wins. Let's go. Round six. Bro, we lost. Game one was 44 minutes, bro. And I didn't put Cowboy in my deck. If I put Cowboy in my deck, I won round two, and this would have been a draw. So if I had Cowboy in my side deck, it will be X1-1. One, one. Bro, games are long this format. Game one, 44 minutes. I actually lost it. It was winnable. It's the first time I could say I made a misplay. I made a misplay. It's so much, like, I would, even, I would consider it a major one because it cost the whole game, but I was making, it was super late, like, we have three, I guess three cards in his extra deck, I have three, like four cards in my extra deck, like 44 minutes of a game. I have one last Astrolot left. I didn't use Lightheart yet, and I went, I had everything in my grave, and I went Astrolot fast because of time, and I banished both of my, like, Beasts, uh, both Beasts, 
the level four and the Vice Star Frost. Because I, I should have banished the, the right card and the Vices, uh, Star Frost, saving the Vices from Sara. Because I didn't use Light Heart yet. So I would have gone a rival. You guys don't care. I just lost. It's important. That's the only thing that matters. Excuses are not important. The only thing that matters is the results. So we lost. We're still, we're still in it. We're still in it because there's 2,600 players and 12 rounds on 11. So we're literally still in it. I'm about to pull off the greatest comeback of all time. It's what I'm all about. Six rounds to go. Six rounds to go. Three today, three tomorrow. I have to win all six. All six must be won or else I ought to lose. So I must do it. Yo, will I win six straight? Okay, but outside the venue, yes. No. Outside. I can't get in trouble outside. Guys, day one just finished. So I didn't give you guys an update for the last three rounds. That's because I was busy winning them all. Let's go. We're still in, baby. Let's go. Uh, those are some three crazy matches, though. Three back to back to back. It was some really crazy matches. I think it was like Tier Limit, Tier Limit, and then Christopher Nielsen at the end with a really cool Labyrinth deck. Because like Labyrinth Unchained, but does everything Unchained does end board wise and just plays all Labyrinth. Like, this is better. That was a great match for Sam, man. Great match for all of them. But uh, we pulled through. Bro, every game was hard, every match was hard, but we pulled through, our deck did exactly what it was supposed to do with the exception of the first two rounds where we got very unlucky with the first two rounds, but we started out winless, starting round three winless, bro. Starting round three winless. We might as well have just came two hours late and then winning out the other seven. Well, we went six and one the other seven. So we're now X two one. So we're one win, one draw, and then we won three. And we lost only one three. So now we're at six two one. Uh, tomorrow, but it's twelve rounds, and uh, twenty four hundred twenty four eighty eight players. Which means all we have to do now is just win the next three, and we top. So that's all we got to do. Just win the next three, three games. That's easy. No problem. We've done it before. We've won twenty in a row before. So let's win three tomorrow, and then we're gonna win six in a row after that. We're gonna win every game tomorrow. Let's go, baby. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Tomorrow's top cut. Let me get some rest. I'm tired and win it tomorrow. Let's go. YCS Italy, sad story time. First two rounds, winless, like a bozo. Next seven rounds, I play like Yugi Moto himself, destroying everyone. I had no business winning these games. Nine negates, eight negates, no problem. One, somehow make day two against all the odds. I just gotta win out and I top. I'm gonna top no matter what. I'm the best player in the game. What happens? I fucking oversleep, bro. Oh my God, and I missed the round. So to punish myself, my hand slipped and I accidentally booked a trip to Paris. So I'm guessing I'm going to Paris now. Later. So we don't wake up for day two. It's all good. Life goes on, guys. Life goes on. We destroy everyone and day one. Don't even wake up for day two. And day three, I'm in fucking Paris. So it's all fucking good. Life lesson here. Ash Ketchum, did he complain when he couldn't get the Squirtle or the Charmander? No, he got the Pikachu. And how did that go for him? So things might not go as you plan. A little life lesson to end off the vlog here. It might not go as you plan. However, make the most of it and uh take life by the balls ash ketchup ta taught me that all right guys hope you have an amazing day i know i will i'll see you guys in the next vlog peace